we will see how to install and use penetrometer. First we will take the screw out of the stand. Then we will place the stand in the hole on the stand base and screw in the screw from underneath the base. We will insert the height adjustment lock into the penetrometer. Then we will attach the penetrometer to the stand. After getting the penetrometer to our desired height we will rotate the height adjustment lock to lock the penetrometer in its position. After that we will plug the wire from the penetrometer into the timer unit to connect the two. We will insert the red connector into the red socket and black connector into the black socket. Next we will attach the needle to the push rod. To attach it, we will take out the horizontal screw and put the needle into the small hole on top of the push rod. After putting in the needle we will tighten it in its place with the horizontal screw. Similarly we can attach a cone attachment to the push rod. To attach the cone to the push rod we will insert the cone into the hole and tighten it with the screw. Then we will place the push rod into its slot in the penetrometer. We will adjust the height of penetrometer such that the tip of the needle touches the surface of the sample in the container. We will then use the bigger and smaller dial on the penetrometer to adjust the needle to zero. Then we will adjust the time by using the small buttons above and under the numbers on the timer. Then we will press the reset button to release the push rod and let the needle sink in the sample till the timer shows double zero. Then when the timer ends we will rotate the smaller dial on the penetrometer clockwise till it is stopped by the push rod, showing us the final reading. Your penetrometer is ready to be used. Thank you.